I'm Jennifer Murphy. I'm from Ireland. I'm a violinist. Well, I've been here at the Royal Conservatory. This is my third year now. Um, I did the two-year artist diploma here, and now I'm doing the one-year Rebanks Fellowship. So I've been playing lots of solo stuff, lots of chamber music, orchestra projects. I was playing at a festival in Ireland with um, Barry Douglas, a very famous pianist, wonderful pianist, and we played together and she was one of the students and we hit it off and uh, she was a student at the Guildhall at the time. A year later she emailed me, she said I'd like to come and study at the Royal Conservatory. I said, yeah, sure, come. She arrived in February, was it three years ago, that awful winter that we had. And she's been fantastic. She's a huge talent. She's uh, just, a, just a total natural musician. And uh, she's fit in beautifully here. Uh, she took a chance coming. You know, it's a long ways away. She didn't know very much about this place. You know, there's a tendency when you're playing with the orchestra uh, to kind of let them take over. You know, when it's a 2D section and you're actually joining into the, into the mix or into the texture, uh, you let them lead the way, you have to do the opposite. In fact, these last chords at the end here, you need to lead these, and I think you're following him. Well, I had always wanted to go somewhere uh, further away from home just to see, and I had actually met my teacher, Erica, Erica Rom, at a master class in Ireland. Um, that was in 2012, I think, and I just thought she was great. And so we kept in touch a little bit, and then when I was deciding where to apply to. I applied here and I came here and it's beautiful and it has an amazing facilities and it's a wonderful place so I thought that seemed like a good option. <laughs> so I'm playing the Corn Gold Violin Concerto um, in the concert tonight and this piece was composed in 1945 um, and Korngold is very often known for his film music, more so than anything else. Um, and so this piece is, it's very cinematic and it's, it, it actually takes a lot of its themes from different films, fil films that he scored. Um, but I, I chose it just because it's beautiful. I mean, I love to play it. It's, it's one of my favorites. Maestro Toby is wonderful. He, it's, it's been an honor to work with him this week. Um, he's a very, very nice man and he, he is the, probably the foremost conductor of the Corn Gold Concerto. I would have been very excited if, if he had been the conductor for her on any concerto, whether it had been Mendelssohn, Tchaikovsky, I would have thought that she was, uh, that she hit the jackpot there. But then you add to that that it's the Corn Gold, and he's, what are people telling me? He's done it 70 times, he won a Grammy for this concerto. And it happens to be one of these kinds of concertos that are very intricately scored. It's my first time playing it, so it's amazing for me to be working with someone who knows it so well and, and can, can, help, can help me and help the orchestra in, in such great ways. Within my career time, which is the last 40 years, this work has gone, not because of me, but within my time, it's gone from being a very obscure violin concerto to a standard work of the repertoire. Auditions use it to, um, uh, to, to test out candidates for orchestral positions, uh, so audition committees are very fond of it. Um, it's played uh, a lot by young violinists like Jennifer. It's uh, a piece that taxes the violin to the utmost.
he's been very helpful to me. You know, he knows the piece a, like a lot better than I do, so he's been very helpful, but he's also um, allowing me to very much do what I want to do, and he's just helping that to happen. The Rebanks Fellowship, boy, the, the, this came along at a fantastic time for Jennifer. I mean, what it offers is full freedom in terms of what you're pursuing, what you're, um, the time that you have, the resources that you have here at the conservatory. So when they asked me if I would do the Congo with Jennifer Murphy, I mean, Jennifer, was, I'd never heard of her before, um, but, you know, that's the lottery of life. You take a chance, and then a young uh, kid like James Ennis comes along, or Gil Shaham, now it's Jennifer Murphy, and um, I'm showing the corn gold again. And I think that's what's so beneficial about this program, because uh, there is this sort of knowledge locked away, and uh, to be able to share it uh, with somebody like that, who's so mature and poised as a young uh, woman, it's so wonderful to, uh, to see that kind of artistry.